Hey all you beautiful people, welcome to my channel. My name is Mika and today we are going on an island tour. Um, this is my first island tour so I'm extremely excited. We are going to be checking out Nook Cove that was created by Beth. And to me it's such a magical place. I love the whole vibe of the island. It's everything that, it just embodies everything that I love in the game. Uh, the whole nature vibe it has makes me extremely happy <laughs> and um, I can't wait for you guys to see it yourselves. Gotta get the dodo code. Here we go. Oh, I think I'm opening my gate. Cool. Great. I've never, uh, you know, spoken and done this at the same time. So uh, I guess I messed up. <laughs> Anyways, uh, these are some of my favorite YouTube videos to watch, so I'm extremely excited to be doing it myself. And I feel like it's gonna be pretty fun. So, be sure to stick around because at the end of the video, I did a Q&A. It's not a live q and I don't know how to get someone's voice so clear, like how other creators do it, but... Um, I did ask some questions on Instagram. If you uh, love following Animal Crossing Instagrams, you have to check out Nook Cove's Instagram, or sorry, Beth's Instagram. It's called Nook.Cove. I'll leave it in the description down below. And yeah, check her out. Her Instagram is just so aesthetically pleasing and very beautiful to the eye. I totally recommend checking her out for some inspo. Um, she's really awesome and sweet and I'm just really grateful that she wanted to do this video with me. So thank you so much, Beth. All right, guys. So we're headed off. Make sure if you like this sort of thing, give it a thumbs up to let me know that you like it and leave a comment down below so you can let me know what you guys think of the island really digging this whole island tour thing and you know I don't have really have any friends on here so I think it's a great way to just um, meet new people online that are playing the same game as me oh my gosh guys we're off this is so cool okay so yeah leave a comment down below and if you'd like to you know subscribe hit that subscribe button and that bell don't forget that bell to let you guys know when I'm uploading Oh my gosh, do you see how beautiful it is? Look at that, guys. Look at that. Like, I'm telling you, this this whole vibe of her island is everything I want to do with my island. <laughs> but she does it so well, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, hi Beth. Look how beautiful this entrance is. And I love her crown. Hold on, she's typing. Let's look at the map while she's typing because she's letting me know something on her Instagram. So this is her map. She has Marcy, yes, Anka, wow, Audi, Inge, I can't say that. <laughs> hey guys, future Mika here editing the video and that is clearly Agnes. I have no idea why I wanted to say Angus, but there you have it. Um, I'm probably going to butcher at least one more name, so sorry. Julian, Kyle, Lobo, Deirdre, <laughs> Maddie, and Victoria. What an awesome lineup of villagers. And just look at her map. It has a heart in the middle of the island that I'm just now noticing and I love the spacing that she has for her villagers. Just what you guys, her terraforming and design and style, it really shows all her hard work and effort that she put into her island and I'm so excited for you guys to see this. So let's get on with the tour. Awesome, and we're gonna go to her passport. Sorry, I'm- oh, that's mine. I don't really know how to look at hers then. Do I just click it over here? <laughs> I don't know how to do the passport, guys. I'm sorry. Wow, okay. So as you can see here, 
she already has some awesome terraforming going on with the waterfalls in the background and how the items are displayed everything about this entrance is so unique and cool i haven't seen anything like this and it looks like she's ready to go and look at this beautiful entryway what i love about her island is it's just so effortless the way everything is put in <laughs> I love the twirl, so cute. <laughs> and yes, I love this whole space theme. Let me see. Oh, can't lose our guide. So we're going through this little pathway. Wow, it's like its own little museum area. Hey, Lobo! Oh my gosh! I'm so jealous she has Lobo. Oh! It looks like I can't, I can't, oh. <laughs> I guess it's not letting me go on. <laughs> ah! <laughs> okay, that was, that was pretty funny. Okay, I love her little hybrids in the background. You know, if you've seen my first few videos, you know that I love the flowers in this game. Oh my gosh, this is such a great idea. I love it. Great idea on the beach. I never would have thought of that. Look at her. Is this her campsite? This has to be her campsite. I love this so much. I what i love about this part is that she leaves okay yeah this is a campsite wow what i love about this part sorry i didn't finish my sentence um is that she leaves the weeds and the weeds during this time is just so beautiful and oh my gosh she has the rat i don't know how to say it correctly ratten rat ratten chairs i need i need another one of those if you saw my first video you saw that i did not have enough supply <laughs> but we're working on it i love this whole area this is such a cute little deck area and just look at her terraforming all right like what you're gonna notice is how beautiful and effortless this terraforming is on her island i love that her campsite is on the beach <laughs> and everything else that we've seen has been amazing oh yeah you gotta have a basketball court you gotta have a basketball court. <laughs> this is so smart. It's literally like a gym. Like you have your vending machine and some snacks to have. Wow, just wow, look at this. There's Victoria. Look at this. I've never seen so many flags being used or I'm not really sure what those are called, but I've never seen so many of those being used. That has, I don't know who this is, but wow, wow, I love, oh wait, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that, I didn't mean to do that, <laughs> wow, this is so beautiful, look at her height, I said high sense, on the top of it, where'd she go, oh, there she is, <laughs> Audie's house, Julian's over here, hey Julian, you're fabulous, Wait, what? I don't know what just happened there. I can't see. Oh, there there it is. I don't know what's going on. But this little picnic area is so cute. I'm following your lead, girl. <laughs> okay. That's so cute. I got a little lost there, but it's okay. She's leading the way. Wow, look at the flooring. Hey guys, future Mika again. Wow, that that is a pathway. That's not flooring. Hopefully you guys can cut me some slack since this is my first tour. But I do know that's a pathway, I promise. I wonder if she made this herself or like she got it online because it's so pretty. <gasps> and that's my favorite butterfly! Wow. Where'd she go? 
over here. Okay. Look at this flooring. Oh my gosh. And this and this terraforming. Oh, look at that. Who? I've never seen that before. I need to somehow implement that into my island because that waterfall was gorgeous. Ooh. Little bamboo trees. Oh, <gasps> so cute. <laughs> I love this little area. You could for sure play hide and seek in here if this was a real place. Oh my gosh, did I lose her already? Oh, okay. <laughs> I need to stop. I need to pay attention. I just keep looking at everything. Look at all the details. <laughs> yes, she put on a show for us. She did. This is great. Julian, nice to see you again, dude. You almost poked me in my eye. Okay. Look, Cove. I love how she has that at the end of every... Not every, but I like how she has it at the end of the street. Or the road. Wow. Look at this area. You see how everything is just so effortless in this island? Just look at her terraforming too. I love the whole aesthetic with the with the flags. <gasps> this must be her house. Yeah, this is definitely her house. Look at the terraforming. Wow. Look at her little dog house and the moon. Wow, this is just some amazing terraforming. I'm sorry, I'm a little quiet just because I've never I've never seen such amazing terraforming how does someone just create this with their mind like even the the top part of the little ter like the second layer right there with the gold rose that's just so pretty the detail is just amazing wow i absolutely love this part of her island like, the whole entrance to her house. Why can't I go in? <laughs> okay. It really gives me some ideas, though. I, I love that whole... <gasps> okay, guys. This... Is so... Awesome. <laughs> this room... It's just, it's just a library, I know, but it just looks so clean <laughs> and organized and I love it. Look, at, I didn't even see the fireplace. I love it. Wow. This is somewhere I definitely want to chill in real life. I love the whole blue and white theme she has going on. Oh, I should switch the camera that way. <laughs> oh my gosh, if you guys ever needed any inspo, this whole room is a vibe. Oh my gosh, I just love the carpet on the floor, or the rug on the floor, the wood flooring. The white accents with the green and tan and brown accents. Everything is just well done and put together in this room. How, how, this is just crazy to me how people can just come up with all of this stuff. Wow. 
Great job. I f love that room. Okay. Let's walk into the next room. The gym! Woo! Gotta have a gym. Especially in this quarantine. Look, this is this is exactly where all of the workout supply went. Right here in Nook Cove. She got everything before it was sold out. Clearly. <laughs> Yeah, that's something I wanted to do, too. With my island, I wanted to make... Or, with my house, I wanted to put an indoor gym. Um, so, eventually, one day, we will do that. Oh, wow, it's like... Is this her kitchen? This kitchen is humongous. I forget how big everything could be. Down here. Or, like, how much more space you have down here. Wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just had to touch that. I don't know why. But I love the whole black and red and gold. It's really pretty and really well done. It really does give me inspo for my for my kitchen because I wanted my kitchen to be white and tan and I never really envisioned it another way. But seeing that, that was that was pretty great. Oh my gosh. This is her bedroom. I need to sh be shocked because this is just this is just amazing. I love her room. I wish this was my room. <laughs> I love the turtle shell theme here. Oh my gosh. It's on the bed. It's on the couches. It's under the lamp. Or what is that called? That's not a lamp. <laughs> this is future Mika confirming that that is, in fact, a lamp. It's a table lamp. So there you have it. I really wish I would stop letting my nerves get the best of me. <laughs> it's so cringe to watch this back while editing. But let's continue. <gasps> wow. And the teddy in the you got to have a teddy bear in your room, okay? Oh, there's the switch. Cool. I just love everything here in this room. <laughs> Her whole house is pretty much everything I want to do with mine. <laughs> no, I can't I can't copy her, but I love it. I love it so much. Yes, that was so beautiful. We didn't see the back room because that's a surprise on her Instagram. So if you want to go check out what she's been up to, she's been doing some giveaways, so Go check her out. Oh, was that an entrance? What about here? Can we go in there? Cool. <laughs> oh, wow. Wow, the diagonal bridge goals. Look at this. Okay, where'd she go? <gasps> Look at the flowers. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry I'm walking through your flowers. I'm so sorry. I'm s extremely sorry. I know we have to walk through them, but... <laughs> They're so beautiful! Uh, go! Wow, this terraforming. Look at the stuff on top, too. Wow. Oops. Taking a picture of that. Oh, Red's here. That was amazing. I love this whole section right here. If we could just, let's see. 
I wish we could just turn the camera to the left and right. <laughs> that would just be so amazing to see all the angles better. Oh, and this little... I love it! Yes! And there's the ore fish in the back. How cute. Look at all the detail. Wow. Inspo, guys. This is true inspo right here. And I really love how she's incorporated the wedding furniture. It just brings really nice touches to her island. Look at the waterfalls by the staircase. What a cool idea. <laughs> you didn't lose me. <gasps> Pizza, please. Yes. Would love some. <laughs> We clapped at the same time. Okay. The cove. Oh, this is her entrance to her museum. That was funny. I like how the tortoise moves. And look at the waterfalls. Wow. And that is just so cool. And she has the fossils as little touches around it. Really nice. Really nice idea. Oh, wow. Cool, look at this outdoor library. So pretty. Oh, this must be your favorite part. <laughs> no, that's so pretty. I like the chess, look at that. And look at that player, the music player. It's currently playing Animal City, okay? I can't hear anything because I don't have headphones yet. So, cool, I lost her. <laughs> This time I lost her. Oh, she's up there. I wonder what was down there. <gasps> wow. 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 <laughs> this place is so cool, you guys. I love the whole white and teal. And, like, the green. Look at that. Look at this. Okay, let's go out of here. I love the flooring, so cute. That sign is adorable. I wonder what's down there. Oh, it's a sh these are sharks. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I wanna see what's down there. Man, I just love her little pathways. <gasps> so cute! <laughs> I'm pretending like I'm eating. Okay. That's a cute little section. I'd love to have that in front of my house. Wow. Whoa! Whoa, I just feel like this is never ending. This island just feels so huge. And it really does give me ideas. Like, her terraforming for this island is just so cool. And she's done things that I never thought of doing so definitely gives me inspo for sure okay so it looks like we're on the the beach oh we got a little like a you know can't even think of any words right now but she has a seaweed i love this part oh oh i've never seen that before i haven't i haven't played much so I haven't played much, so I haven't seen that thing yet. <laughs> I haven't tried the jumping in the water yet, but it looks so cool and I can't wait to try it out. Man, I can't believe I don't remember what that was called. <laughs> oh, cute little bug collection. Good little pathways. Man, just so effortless. 
Look at I just feel like she has so many things here. I feel like I've seen already ten bridges. Oh, look at the little candles. Oh! Cut. <laughs> through there okay oh here we go look at that it's kind of hidden oh is that it cool wow such a great tour thank you so much Beth I loved everything about it it's such an amazing idea and like I kept saying throughout the whole video so effortless Thank you so much, Beth, and hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. So we are now going to get started on the interview portion of the video. And um, like I said before, I wasn't able to actually get Beth on the phone just because with audio, I'm not quite sure on how to do that yet. So one of the first questions I asked Beth was, what was her inspo for her island? And she replied, Inspo wise, I played a lot of the old Animal Crossings and we could, couldn't exactly terraform like this in those games. So I learned to love the natural design. So I think my island is just based off nature and wilderness. But also, sometimes in real life, when you go down a street and they have a parade, they have the little flags lining the streets. And I wanted to replicate that, hence why there's marketplace decorations everywhere. Which was actually one of my favorite parts of Beth's Island as well. I loved how she had the flags everywhere. I feel like it just gave it a unique touch that I haven't seen before on any island tours. Another question I asked Beth was, Do you have any tips for anyone having a hard time coming up with ideas for their island? Beth said, I think if you can't decide what to do with an area on your island, you need to think about what you're missing. Do you have a seating area? Is it big enough for multiple people to visit your island? Is it themed? Like how I have a diner and a pizza cafe and a bonfire. Also, whenever I have loads of empty space, I always place down flowers because I think they're so pretty. Which is such a great tip, Beth. I absolutely love how you've placed the flowers all throughout the island. Okay, so then I asked her, when did she start playing Animal Crossing New Horizon and was this her first Animal Crossing game? She said she started playing New Horizons the day it came out, her boyfriend bought it for her, and a Switch to play on as an early birthday present. That is so freaking sweet. Props to him. And um, she's been playing Animal Crossing since Wild World. That's so cool. I heard so many good things about the older games. I wish I would have started sooner. Then I asked her how many hours she played, and... She currently has 555 hours of playtime and it shows her island is just so beautiful. I could go on and on about it because I just love her whole theme and aesthetic for the island, but 555 hours. Wow. That is insane. Lee cool. <laughs> I also asked her what her favorite part of the game was, and she said her favorite part is everything to do with the sea. She loves fishing, and now that she can dive, she couldn't be any happier. I couldn't agree more with you, Beth. The sea, anything to do with the sea is really fun to me. Didn't mean to rhyme there, but I did. <laughs> For the last question, I asked her what her favorite part of her island was, and she said her favorite part of her island is the view over her house. I think it's such a cool perspective and I love how you can see all the different flowers and waterways and stuff. Just too cute in my humble opinion. Honestly, yes Beth, that area, the way you terraformed it was so amazing and cool. I don't understand how you did that and how you came up with that, but you are truly an Animal Crossing inspiration. <laughs> but. Yeah, if you guys noticed, that was the thumbnail of this video. So, if you like Beth's Island or you want to get some more inspiration from her or have any questions, 
give her a follow on Instagram. She is always active on there. So check her out if you can, guys. And if you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel if you want to see more content like this. Don't forget to hit that bell notification so you're notified when I post to this channel. You can also follow me on Mika Chu Crossing on Instagram and Mika Chu Cross In without the G on Twitter. If you guys want to be a part of my next island tour video feel free to send me a dm on instagram or twitter and i'd be more than happy to set that up with you guys so thank you again so much hope you guys have a good rest of the day or night wherever you are and i'll see you on the next one